Hi, Greg Howie from Fitzpatrick's Real Estate with a wrap-up of the uh, commercial section for the month. Great news today is that we went on exhibition for uh, council for the Sturt Street Riverside Apartments development, which incorporates some commercial areas as well. And I've got to say, this is probably one of the most exciting projects I've been involved with, where we're looking at a 17-storey apartment building, uh, which will really transform the city and take us from a country town to a country city. Call our office and talk to any of the sales staff and we're happy to send you out information on that development. Very exciting and it will just uh, change the whole structure of the CBD for us. CBD is going uh, reasonably well. Obviously retail is a little down at the moment. It's interesting that a number of the shops that are closed in Baylor Street are not a reflection of the local trading, they're a reflection of the corporate um, issues that have plagued retailing in Australia. Local uh, shops for the, some of the nationals that closed were, were trading rather well, uh, but from a corporate level they strolled and uh, in the end the local shops paid the price and closed. It will change and it just takes a little bit to sort those out. Overall, uh, when you've got a city where around 50% uh, of the population is aged under 35, housing is strong, uh, retailing is strong, we've got two defence bases, a university. The future is just very good for the city. Uh, we go through a little quiet periods, but overall investment is very, very secure in Wagga and uh, we look forward to talking to you about your investment needs. Greg Howick signing off and we'll see you for our next edition of the update for uh, commercial real estate in Wagga Wagga.